Hi there, it's Jill Havens. I'm here to talk to you today about speaking in public and is that something that you're afraid to do? I know I'm a little bit afraid to do it and I have been my entire life. Um, I remember back when, I don't know, it was about 15 or 20 years ago. Ah, uh, let's say 15. Um, I was a party light consultant and if, if you guys know what that is, you have to get up in front of a room full of people and sell your products and I just loved the product so much that I was willing to do it and I I didn't you know the first few times I did it I about died of a heart attack I was so scared but I did it and I even started getting up and talking at meetings um, just to get you know just to get over that fear um, and, and you know I did it but I haven't talked in front of people since then so uh, what it really boils down to if you're nervous about talking in front of people um, public speaking, that all has to do with your self-image. And a book I can recommend to help with that is Psycho-Cybernetics. It's one of the best books out there uh, for self-image. It's, it's, an, it's, an it's an old book, but man, some of those old books are still just as good today. So I would definitely recommend picking that up. Because once you realize the first step in solving any problem is acknowledging what it is. And once you acknowledge that you have a problem with self-image, that's the first step to fix it. And you can. It is fixable. It's definitely fixable. Um, what, you know, I do videos all the time. And in the very beginning, I was afraid to do videos. I mean, I did it, but I was nervous. I was afraid I might mess up. Well, who cares if you mess up? This is an imperfect world, and people like you more if you do mess up. You know, you're just like anybody else. <laughs> and, and the people you're speaking to like, like to see that. Um, and like I said, I'm, I'm very confident now with doing videos. It's, they're, they're easy. But the way business is going, uh, I have a feeling that someday, in the not-too-distant future, I may be asked to speak somewhere. I may be asked to get on a hangout with people I don't know, with lots of people watching, or I might be asked to get on a call. And that makes me a little bit nervous. So I, I need to work on my self-image. And again, acknowledgement is the first step. So um, you and me both need to work on that. <laughs> one, one tip I can offer you, though, um, is... Everybody has had moments of confidence in their life. So what you can do is anchor a feeling of confidence. And what I mean by that is take yourself back to a moment where you felt confident. Get into that feeling and snap your fingers and just feel it. Anchor it. And then when you get to that thing that makes you nervous, whether it's public speaking or anything else, when you are getting ready for that, snap your fingers Bring yourself back to that feeling of confidence because the more the more practice, the more times you do that, the closer you're going to get to feeling comfortable. And pretty soon it's going to be as easy as talking to somebody on Facebook, as easy as doing a video. All you got to do, anchor the feeling, remember it, practice it. You are good to go. And again, uh, one of the best books out there to help with your self-image, Psycho-Cybernetics. So I would definitely recommend picking that up. And hopefully this video helped. If it helped you, if you liked it, I would sure appreciate a like, a comment, or even share it with your friends. Until next time, we'll see you soon.